morning, everybody. Welcome to another episode of Coffee Time on Bourbon and Booze. It's a early Wednesday morning, and I want to introduce to you something rather kind of unique, and I never thought that we would do, but that's really, really budget coffee. Uh, we picked up, and unfortunately, it's a single pot, so that's why there's just a wrapper laying here. We picked up a uh, coffee from the Dollar Tree. So if you're not familiar with Dollar Tree, it's a kind of like Dollar General, Dollar really low budget, low um, cost items. It's kind of a, I don't know, a misnomer name. Not, it's not like everything costs a dollar. Not like, a, um, well, I don't think everything costs dollar at Dollar Tree. It's just very inexpensive. And so this is the uh, Mize Cafe Gourmet Organic Coffee. It's their Rainforest Blend. Not very much on the internet about this at all. Uh, I can't find, I've gone to the uh, Mize Cafe uh, company and it's, it's a, what's it called? Um, oh, Greenbrier International, Inc. And it says it's a product of Brazil, but this is actually from Virginia. It's 100% Arabica. It's a kind of a dark blend. Uh, this package makes up to 10 cups, so it's a single drip um, coffee pot maker. I haven't had it yet, so I don't know what the flavor is going to be. It is a blonde roast, though, so it's a very light roast, but it turns out somewhat dark. I think they say 10 cups. I have a 12 cup pot, coffee pot, and it's still was more gra uh, grounds than I would normally put in a coffee pot, so this is extra extra scoopage if you ask me. It's a pleasant flavor. Not too earthy, more aroma like a cocoa chocolate. Doesn't really smell like coffee. It says it's the Rainforest Blend. Not sure really what that is. And I actually prefer blonde coffee, that lighter roast. It smells pretty good, so that's my preferred for breakfast. Mm, very um, smooth but light tasting. Not a lot there. A little bit of a watery um, diffused coffee flavor. I don't know that I would drink this straight. I think I would have to have a flavored creamer or a regular creamer with a little bit of sugar just to sweeten it up because it is a very mellow blonde coffee. Um, but you know it only cost I think it was two bucks is what we picked it up for. Like I say, it's hard to find um, any information on this. If you go to the Dollar General webpage, you can only buy it in a case. And I think a case of 24 and it averages about 20 bucks. So it's just over a dollar to between $2 a piece. I think we have another one. I might have even actually done it. I can't remember the Suave Coffee, different company, but still from the Dollar Tree. Tell us what you think about this kind of coffee, like really inexpensive dollar um, type coffee, whether you like it, it's definitely for people who are on a low budget. Uh, however, I mean, this is one cup or one pot. So when you start adding this up to what you could get in a normal, I don't know, Folgers or, uh, you know, uh, community package, you're probably better off buying those than this but it is organic so if that's something that's really important to you um, it might be something worth picking up overall not very bad I don't see that I would not buy this again if I saw it especially if I'm traveling and I just want a small packages um, for coffee because we always take a little coffee pot either a press pot or a mocha pot with us so uh, yeah this would actually work pretty well as a press pot coffee at work you could put half of it in or whatever however big your press pot is but tell us what you think um any other coffees we should try let us know make sure you hit that like and subscribe check out all of our other videos monday through friday we have um vodkas and gins and tequilas and non-whiskeys on mondays M tuesdays and thursdays are whiskeys either a whiskey or whiskey flavored um alcohol Wednesdays, of course, is coffee, and then Friday we end the week and start the weekend with cocktails with Cody. So make sure you check those all out, and we hope you have a great Wednesday, and we'll see you tomorrow for whiskey. Cheers.